Hey everybody, welcome to the video. Welcome to the channel. We are headed out today to do a little bit of cleanup at an old trailer court. There's some stuff we gotta get busted up, cleaned up, trucked out. Should be a pretty good video, I'm excited about it. Just got done servicing the C8500, so I don't know, maybe a video on that coming up as well. You guys saw this at some point, didn't you? I don't know, might cut the trailer in half. Look at this, it's fancy. Aaron's in here working on the trailer. See, he's in here working on the trailer. Man behind the scenes. You guys tune into his channel to see what he's doing on this trailer. He's worked on, is this the third trailer this week you've been working on? Third one. Third trailer this week. He's done quite a bit of work. So he's got a lot of good stuff coming up. So be sure to stay tuned to his channel. Link in the description as always. Get my bag in here. Mike said he had some stuff in the back. Let's see what we got. Oh, that's a lot of parts and pieces. Okay. Okay. We're gonna go get that scrap metal dumped off of here, get a load of dirt, and see what we're getting into. This is the moment where I wonder if I put the oil plug back in. You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm sure it's it fine. Is. Oh, clutch.
loaded up with our fill dirt. We are headed to the job now. I guess I guess I'll see you guys in a little bit. I guess so. Alright, so here's the situation. We just pulled up to see that. Got the Cat 304 Mini Excavator, of course the Kubota skid steer over there as well. That is a new Dollar General. I know, we're all shocked. A new Dollar General in the middle of nowhere? No, not possible. Oh yeah, it's happening. Anyway, this used to be a trailer court. There's a trailer pad there. You see the concrete, that's gotta come out. Trailer pad here, that concrete's coming out and then we've gotta get the deck, all this trash and uh, that shed out of here. See what's in this shed. See what we got going on here. I'm assuming not a whole lot. Yeah, okay. All right. Cardboard. Yeah. Oh, some fine china. What do we got here? Gibson china. Is that worth anything? I don't know. It's about to not be. I'll tell you that. It's about to not be. Let's see what's on the. Oh, look at there. The black and decker. That's nice. See what's over here. Anything exciting? I doubt it. Oh, a good gas can there. Not bad. Nothing really. Well, we'll just touch that with the excavator next, I suppose. Awesome! I'm saving some pallet wood for a project. Yes, Pinterest. Not bad. So it's not too crazy in here. Not too bad at all. where we're gonna put the truck let's just back in right here bud let's just do that and I'll just work all the concrete this way kapowie just like oh it's gonna be magical gonna be magical look at this thing what is going on there you're gonna get that checked out bud I don't think that's normal I don't think that's normal set on these water lines just uh dig down a little bit cut them and bury them They've, everything's been all the utilities have been cut off deadheaded made obsolete whatever you want to call it well that's what we're gonna do but i kind of feel like an idiot i left my knife at mike's shop this morning so I'll try to butcher these with a set of 10 snips that i happen to have in the truck with me that brick will hold you guys up i don't know if i can get them to do that Okay. We're just gonna kind of work everything over to a pile by the truck. And we'll load it up from there. I'm guessing this concrete, this concrete probably doesn't have any rebar mesh or anything in it for that matter, so it should come up.
just spotted this one random pad. That's where we just loaded all that out. See the truck? See the excavator? You got it. This one random pad that's got to go. So I just kind of pulled it out. I don't want to beat and bang on it to break it up. I just kind of pulled it out, made it sit uneven, and I'll probably just track across it. Hopefully that breaks it up enough I can get it in the truck okay. And we got this little bit of sidewalk. We'll get that dirt spread with the, you know, that thing over there. And then we'll start on that mess. not gonna be like a big fancy finished yard obviously we're gonna take the dirt we brought and just mix it in with what's there and you know put the old shine on her that's what we're gonna do the old shine on her
is pulled, but it's still attached. Shed's pretty much cleaned up. I need to bring a uh, scoop shovel. Well, I guess I've got that scoop shovel, but I need to bring something to clean that off a little bit better with tomorrow. I'm just going to leave that for now. That's loaded up, ready to go. So tomorrow morning, we've got the rest of the concrete we've got to get out and hauled off. And then we've got this deck we have to get apart and in the truck. And I'm debating, I think I can get that in one trip on that truck. It's going to be close. But I think I can. Oh, I got that little thing there too. Still a little bit more to do, but uh, I'm gonna go get this dumped and then I'll just meet you guys in the morning. We'll pick up right where we left off. Good morning. Look at that. What a beautiful morning too. That load of debris came off just fine. No issues there. I know some of you guys are probably wondering where we're taking that. Best way, to, best way I know to answer that is not every business or place we go to likes being filmed. So we're not filming that side of the operation. Simple as that. You guys get the idea though, it goes on the truck, comes off the truck, and then we backhaul a load of dirt. So that's what we're gonna do. A third load, load of dirt. Oh, wait, wait a second. Wait a second, hold on. I bought one for the 140, you guys saw that. I bought a new broom for the low boy too. So we got a new broom for there. And I bought a new broom for the 120. So the low boy, the 120, and uh, the 140 all have new, my goodness. Get a tandem load of dirt out of this freaking cap. Anyway, all the machines now have, uh, well, most of them now have brooms. That's exciting. How exciting.
missed a little bit. That's okay. It's just fine.
got the deck in the truck, which is nice. Skid steer's warming up right now real quick. I'm just, there's probably one bucket's worth of just miscellaneous trash and debris laying around yet. So I'm gonna get that picked up in the truck. Truck moved out of the way. And then we'll get on to the finished dirt work and get it all looking beautiful. That's the plan anyway. Clean your tips, clean your tips, always clean your tips. Pretty catchy tune. Pretty catchy tune. Okay. It's actually easier to put these on first. In it. Where is it? Oh, there from. what we ended up with not too bad fuel light came on on the uh, skid steer here so i would have liked i don't know another half an hour just to kind of fancy up around the trees and stuff but i think this will be fine definitely a big improvement if you remember this is where the little shed thing was at this is where the deck was concrete pad concrete pad and it all came out and it looks really pretty good i'm pretty daggone happy with it another view from this side looking back shed was by that pole deck was right here not too bad. Pretty big old growth trees sitting here. Be a pretty lot, you know. Dollar General though, so I don't know how I feel about that. And then from this side here, shed, deck, concrete pads. Looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. And a property owner came by and said she was real happy with it. There are a few little things that kicked up that last, oh, that's a stick, that's fine. That can stay. There, there's a little piece of pecs.
little piece of plastic here. We're, uh, I'm going to go around and get this uh, small stuff picked up, thrown on the truck. Go get that truck offloaded, and I'm going to call it a day. Hey, I appreciate you guys watching. I really do mean that. The likes, the comments, the shares. World's crazy. You guys know that. And I get a lot of laughs out of the comments you guys leave for us to read. So I really do. I, I appreciate that a lot. As always, thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.